What's up guys? Welcome back to my witchy world, which is so I'm trying this new thing where I am spending less time editing videos, so I'm going to try to not have to edit this video. I am realizing that editing is taking a lot of time away from me spending it with my son, and I am not not okay with having less time with my son. So, we are kind of we're kind of going backwards from the way that most YouTube channels go. They usually start off with the worst quality and then like gravitate towards the better camera. We're doing reverse. I had a great camera, took too much time to edit it. So now we're back to this and then we're just uploading from here. Um, so, you know, uh, <laughs> if you hear noise in the background, it's my son and the dogs. They are watching a movie. Um, and playing Eddie, yeah. shush please, yeah. thank you. Um, so anyway, so we have a sort of a double unboxing today. So this video, these boxes are from The Witch's Box. Now I used to be subscribed to The Witch's Box a few months ago. And I canceled the subscription because I felt like I wasn't getting a whole lot of value with the subscription box. So, Eddie, please shush. Um, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> um, so, I felt like I wasn't getting the value... For the money that I was paying. I was paying I think $82 in total with shipping. So it just wasn't there for me. Um, but every once in a while, because I do like the stuff that they give out, um, I just didn't, I didn't feel like it was worth $82 at the time. Um, but every once in a while they do these boxes where they are basically trying to just get rid of things. So they do like mystery boxes. And this time around, it was herb mystery boxes. So I got one. Not only did I get one, I got two. <laughs> so a some of the little streamies are sticking out, but so a friend of mine is also interested in herbs and things like that. The sticker on this one's messed up, but um, she's also interested in herbs. So I got two so that we could kind of divvy them up and split them, basically. Um, which she doesn't know yet, so let's shh, keep that a surprise. Um, so I am very, very excited. So here's the deal. I'm going to open one by myself, and then my son has been bugging me to open one with me so him and I will open up the second box. Before we get into this box, you already know what I'm going to ask you. Please make sure you give this video a like. It helps me out so much. It helps other people see my videos. The more likes that it gets, comment down below on what your thoughts are on these mystery boxes and subscribe if you haven't already become part of the karma fam. It's pretty fun here. At least I think so. And uh, if you are already subscribed, make sure you share this video with your friends. All right, let's waste no time. Let's get into this box. So we're going to cut open the label here. Open her up. It's a pretty big box and they're very, very, very heavy. So it is packaged just like all of their... Uh, subscription boxes come. Very nice packaging. The, the stickers are always gorgeous. And we're about to ruin it. <laughs> so we have, first things first on the top here, we have some gray sea salt. Okay, and I actually, I got this in one of the boxes from before, so I'll probably give this to my friend because it does come with a lot. Next we have bay leaves. 
Can't go wrong with Bailey's. Okay, next we have some Wormwood. These are uh, all 7.6 ounces, I believe. This one does not have a an amount on it, so I don't know if that's 7.6 ounces, and this one doesn't have an amount on it. So the only one so far that has an amount on it is this one here, the Wormwood. Okay, so we're not, I'm not opening these packages because they all basically look the same. Um, they look like herbs. You know what, this one's peppermint which is a, a huge favorite of mine. So, oh yes, it smells so good. So it's like filled to about right here. So there's a little bit of an air pocket in there, but not by much. Beautiful. Oh, it smells so good. <laughs> Can't wait to make some peppermint tea. Awesome. Next we have chicory root, 7.6 ounces. So this one has the weight written on it. Eddie, stop with the noise, please. He knows I'm filming and he likes attention, so he likes to make noise in the background so that I, uh, pay attention to him. Oh, this is really cool. It's got an interesting smell. Chicory root. I don't think I have any chicory root. Uh, you can't see my hand. It has a very interesting, like a, like a smoky smell. Mmm. I like the way that smells. It reminds me of um, like barbecues. <laughs> All right, so next we have something that's actually in bubble wrap or like a foam. I thought, I, honest to God, I thought it was all supposed to be herbs, so I don't know what this is. Oh, so I I already got one of these, but I was just saying the other day that I wish that I had another one, like, to do a matching set. So it is a little tea light holder, and it is a piece of um, Himalayan salt. That's really cool. That's why it was so heavy. Oh, this is great. This is awesome. I'm very excited about this. Very, very excited to have another one of these. There's like some, some sand or something in there, <laughs> but this is gorgeous. I'm very excited about this. Like I'm, I am very, very excited about this. Very cool. I wasn't even expecting anything like that. Cool. So next, and I'll leave all the information on what, um, the price of this box was. Ooh, I think some salt got my nose. <laughs> I'll leave all of the information on this box down below. Again, you don't, you can't pick anything that's in this box. So, um, I had, I had no idea what was coming in it. There was no hints. All I knew was that it was an herb box. Um, and I don't know how much I pray I paid, but I, I think, I think from what I'm seeing that I think the price was reasonable. Next we have hibiscus flower petals. Ooh. Okay. I guess I changed my mind on opening them and showing them. Mm. Oh. Ooh. Oops, I keep going the wrong way because my camera is backwards. These are beautiful. Oh, I am very excited for this. Oh, they smell so good. Gorgeous. So excited. So excited. So there is some of the stuff I already had. Some of the stuff I did not have. So I am very, very excited about this. Okay, so next we have another herb. 
This is Skullcap. This is one that I, I do have, but I don't have a lot of it. So this is good. This, I believe, says four ounces, if I'm not mistaken. I think it says four ounces, four ounces. But it's still a lot because Skullcap is a very lightweight herb. Very cool. Mm. Smells herby. <laughs> smells like tea. Very nice. <clears throat> Hitting buttons on my computer. Okay, so we have another bubble wrap item here. This is so intriguing because I was not expecting anything. I was really not expecting anything other than these bags full of herbs. So these are pleasant surprises. Oh, okay. So interesting. So it's a jar of herbs and it is chicory root, which is weird because we also have chicory root. So I got two of the same herb just in two different forms. Interesting. So that's a little, that's a little disappointing because I wouldn't have assumed that they would put two of the same herb in one box. However, I like having the jar. All right, next we have, this says 11 ounces on it. Somehow, I don't think this is 11 ounces. It says cal calendula. I really don't think this is 11 ounces because I got, I got this exact bag from a box a, a little while ago and um, it had, it, it had way, it felt like it had way more in there. Yeah, I don't think that's 11 ounces. That's not a lot at all. Again, calendula is very, very light in weight. So I can't see that being 11 ounces. I think they just took the same labels and put it on there so we knew what it was. But I think the, um, the weights are different. Okay, so it looks like we have one more item in here. I'm just double checking to make sure. Oh no, wait, there's something else. Hold on, let me get these, let me move these wormies because there was a little tiny bag in here. And I will show you what it is in a minute, but I want to make sure that there's not another one like that. No, I think we're good. Okay, we're good. So this box is done. Um, so the little bag that I saw was this guy here. It says it's lavender seeds. I'm not sure if these are like we're supposed to plant these or, or not. Um, you can see oh, at the bottom there. Um, I don't know if these are meant to be planted or not, but I, if they are, I am super excited because I would like to plant them. So that's really cool. I like that. And then if you are new to this channel, then you probably don't know this. Um, but if you've been here a while, you know that there is, um, one definitive way to my heart and it is through books and we were fortunate or i was fortunate enough to receive a book by ellen dugan garden witches herbal green magic herbalism and spirituality so we have a book here this again totally unexpected was not expecting this at all very 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 cool yay yeah so let's look at this box real quick or this this book let's see what's in here magical plants of the south Southwest, wildflowers and witchery, 
It looks like there's some spells in here. There is, um, so there's an herb. And then after the herb is like a little blessing or spell or something after. That's pretty cool. Magic in the hedge hedgerows. I'm excited to read through this. This looks really cool. The ABC charm, Blackthorn or Slow. The Blackthorn reversal candle spell. So there's like the herb. Let's see. So this is the herb here. Okay. Not that you can read it all that, that well. But then on the very next page, so over here, right here, there's a spell that goes with it. I think that's really unique and really cool, and uh, I'm very, very intrigued by this, and I, I really, I really, I'm excited about this. I am really excited about this, and it looks like there's a lot of information written on each herb that's here, so this is really, really cool. Um, I'm, I'm very excited for this. Very, very excited. The book itself is like, it's super like flimsy. The, the soft, the paperback is like, it's like really, really thin, but it's a gorgeous freaking book. Um, like it's, it's just, it like falls over. Oh, I, I, listen, I'm really weird about my books. I love really bendable books because it's just like it's like they're meant to be worked with Ugh, so good okay so that was the first box now I am going to call my son who would like to be a part of this unboxing video and uh, he's gonna help me open the next box Eddie you want to come in Oh, he's in the bathroom. Okay, well, he'll, he'll come out when, uh, when, he's, when he's done in the bathroom. Um, okay, so that is very cool. So, another reason why I got two boxes was because I wanted to see if things repeated itself. Um, sorry, I'm cleaning in between because I hate, I hate when things are a mess. Um, so I wanted to see if things were going to be different or if they were going to be exactly the same. Um, my curiosity intrigued me. Um, and like I said, doubles of things, they are all going to a friend of mine. Um, and, uh, she does not know she's getting it. So I'm sure when she finds out, she'll be very happy. Um, so let's open the second box up. Packaged exactly the same. Okay, so right off the bat, right on top, just like the first box, we have gray sea salt. So that is repeated. The gray sea salt is repeated. Next we have calendula again. It's not it's definitely not 11 ounces. It feels very uh, thin. And any of the ones that are repeated in here, I'm not gonna open the bags up because I'll just save them and give them to my friend. Um, so so far we have two that have been repeated. The first two that we open have are repeats. We have peppermint again. So again, this is a little repeat. Uh, let's see. We have chamomile flowers. I don't, did we get chamomile last time? I know we got hibiscus. Um, no, so we did not, we did not get chamomile. So that's awesome. That is not a repeat, so we'll open her up. Ooh, it smells like honey. Ooh, wow. 
beautiful. Okay, so it is filled to the top. There's a lot in there. That's wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So that is our first non-repeat herb. Next, we have bubble wrap with a jar, and it is chicory root. So now I have three chicory root things here because I got a bag and then the two jars. We have hibiscus flower petals. So this is, again, a repeat. Uh, I'm actually excited to have two of these um, for myself. Sorry. <laughs> um, because those uh, smell delicious. Um, we have some more lavender seeds. Okay. We have some verbena, or ver, ver, verbena, which is vervain. So this is, this is not a repeat. This is awesome to have. I use vervain a lot. Okay, it's pretty full. These are all so, so per over. So you can see it in there, okay? Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so we have olive leaf. Again, not a not a repeat, so this is good. I don't know if I have olive leaf. No, I definitely don't. Oh, this is cool looking. <laughs> Who knew? You know? Here comes my little one. All right, don't be uh, don't be all loud here, okay? All right, so that's olive leaf. Did I sit down on your lap? No, you're gonna sit down right over here and okay. and help me pull things out of the box, okay? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Um, whoops, I knocked my pillow. Alright, we're gonna try and turn this a little bit so you can see his cutie pie face. <laughs> okay, so reach into the box and pull out. Wait, wait, wait. Don't be so rough, dude. Thing's heavy. Here, we'll pull this out so we can see. Okay, pull something out. Okay. So we got a repeat of the book. So this is awesome because I did not want to give this book up. Um, my friend is going to love this book. So it is the same book. It's the garden. I'm running out of space. It's the same book, the Garden Witch's Herbal book. So I am so excited to be able to give this to her. She is... What? I was talking to you. friend. Oh, okay. It's my first... She has to fill with my mommy. <laughs> I'm happy because I shake my head every time. Oh my gosh. Um, so she is, if I had to define her, she is someone who would be a garden witch. Um, so this is perfect for her. She's going to be super excited. <laughs> All right, next one. Pull something else out. Okay. So we have... You guys, I am, oh, I just dropped it. So I dropped it. My back hurts. I'm not going to get it. But you guys, mm -hmm. it is another bag of chicory root. So, wow, that is a lot of chicory root. I got it. That's, thank you so much. So here it is right here. Chicory root. Um, that's a lot of chicory root. <laughs> That, that's, that's a crazy, crazy amount of chicory root. There is so much in front of me right now that I'm starting to get claustrophobic. Um, okay, so I think that leaves us with just one more item. If I am not mistaken. Yeah. So we are done with this box. <laughs> Mommy's going to do this part because I need a knife to cut it open. And my knife is buried under 
a bunch of stuff. So I mean, you can't open that anymore. We're gonna make it work. We're gonna make it work. Here we go. All right. So it is another um, salt lamp tea light holder. Uh, I'm not complaining though at all because I am very, very, very excited to have now three of them. <laughs> um, maybe I'll give one away. It might be kind of hard to do that though. Sorry. Um, I'm being a little selfish because I really do love these. Uh, it's, I work in a spa. If you're new here, hello. I'm an esthetician, licensed esthetician, licensed massage therapist, and we have salt lamps in all of the rooms. Salt, especially now, is very purifying and, um, cute. It's good to have around at this particular time. So that is it for this unboxing. Thank you. Thank you to my lovely little boy for helping me un unbox everything. Um, I have to say, other than other than the massive amount of chicory root, like they must have had just sheesh so I can talk because you're distracting with your cute little face okay um so other than the chicory root uh that's probably the only thing I'm like I was disappointed about they probably had so much chicory root that they just were like just get rid of it put it in the just keep putting it in the the, the boxes because we got two chicory roots in both boxes, one in a jar form, one in a bag form. And the bags are, if I can find it, hold on. Yeah, the bags are not, uh, they did not skimp on these bags. It's filled to the top, like jam packed. There's 7.6 ounces in here, 7.6 ounces in the jar, that's a lot. A lot of chicory root. Um, so obviously the other ones, none, none of the, there was no other repeats in one single box, just the chicory root. There were repeats in the two boxes, but that's okay because that's kind of why I did that, hoping that um, if there were doubles, I could hand it off to my friend. I am not disappointed in this at all. I am so pleasantly surprised to have gotten the books and the, the salt lamps, I just think that's truly amazing. And if they have any more mystery boxes in the future, I'm probably going to buy them. Like, I can feel Because it. that was good. So I'm pretty stocked up for a while on things. So I'm very, very, very excited. We don't have the box yet. Yes, we're going to do that one next. Um, but you can go watch your movie so I can say goodbye to the, my, my peoples uh, out here. Um... Just go put TV on. Go put your show on. Uh, it was the end. I know, babe, but go put a different one on. You, you know how bye to do it. Bye, guys. Until next time. <laughs> <laughs> My good boy. Um. Yeah, so I am... I am very happy with everything that we got here. There's a, there's a wide variety of things. And I have to say... Um, this was very good. I'm, I'm very, I keep repeating myself, but this was very, very good. I need to, I need that to be known. Um, <laughs> so there, there is so much here, so much here. Um, all right, you guys. So that is it for this witch's box, mystery box unboxing. Um, even though I, like I said earlier, even though I'm not a fan of their subscription box, I didn't feel like the value was there. Um, I still really liked the items that were in the box. I just didn't, I couldn't justify spending $82 on things, um, every single month. Every once in a while is okay. So that's why I like these mystery boxes. Um, 
So I think that's it. If I think of anything else, I'll leave it down in the description box below, but I'm pretty sure that's it. Um, so what's the usual spiel? I feel like I'm out of, out of, uh, touch with the, the filming, the filming world. Um, make sure you give this video a like if you liked it. Um, comment down below on what your thoughts are on this box. Do you think the value is there? Check the description box for the pricing and stuff like that. I will have that all listed down below because I can't remember it off the top of my head right now. And um, subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Stick around. Become part of the Karma Fam. And if you are subscribed, make sure you share this video with your friends. Follow me on social media. I am on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. More active on Instagram than anywhere else. But I do post on Facebook and Twitter as well. Um, I, think, I think that's it. Um, anything else will be listed down below. Uh, and I will catch y'all in my next video. Bye, guys.